So um, it's not about finding out about the future, but it's more about understanding where you are now and who you are now and oh, what is the you that you take into the future, into the challenges that you're, you're encountering. Um, there's some other hands that went up, I'm sure. I don't know. Well, presumably, um, at this level where we're live on East, uh -huh. presumably, uh, time isn't linear. Um, yeah. Time doesn't exist. Yeah. So, presumably, you could drop into uh, lives at any period, at any time, future. Yeah, that's, 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 a, that's a good question, yeah. See, um, I've read a... Bear with me on this. I've, I've read a bit of literature. I was talking to my friends in the brain about it. Um, I've read literature in the past. That, that, and some of the points we made here about going to the light is a deception. Because this isn't what you're describing. This, mm -hmm. this is a deception. There are demonic forces that want to keep souls on this plane. Yeah, this is. Uh, this is a. We're basically batteries for negative energy, for war, for hatred, for mm -hmm. lust, for hedonism. It's all negative energy which they thrive off. So they encourage us through the, uh, all the mass media, all television, everything yeah. encourages mm -hmm. when you die, the go to the light. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a deception. Everything, everything tells me that that's a deception. Okay. It, 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 does, it doesn't make sense. It, why, would you keep, why would you keep coming back? over and over again and nothing improves. Because I mean, we're it, slow it, learners. It would be purely selfish, wouldn't it? And, but we, we want to learn deeply. But what about your fellow man? What about fellow humanity? Mm -hmm. When you're, you're here and you might have a moment of happiness that you can take back with you and the rest of it. It's a dog's life. Mm -hmm. And you've made other people's lives a dog's life. What's the point in that? Um, well, I won't argue with you as such. I, I will accept. That, that, that's one version of reality. Where does it take you? How does it leave you feeling about your life and the, and the world around you? Pointless. Well, yeah. Are you happy with that? No. Okay. So, is that version of reality more valid than any other version of reality? Probably not, but it does, it does seem completely and utterly pointless. And it, it just seems to me, if, 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 if with these higher beings, it, it, what's the point? It doesn't doesn't make any sense at all. Surely, surely the, the the place where our light bodies are is the place to be. This isn't the place to be. This is a place to avoid, if anything. So well, <laughs> I all, all, all I can say is what I've been talking about this evening is that although this is um, a tough place to be for many of us, it is still a valuable place to be from the experiences I've had. I, I acknowledge that you have different experiences and you have a different understanding of it, but I have this understanding. Okay. All right. Just to a masochistic soul. Yeah, yeah. So all, 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 all the higher beings are trapped as well. So, well, you, everyone keeps talking about higher beings. Are you on about the revolved souls? There are souls that have been through this and, you know, been there, done that, bought the T-shirt, you know, and and don't feel that they need to anymore and you can access them sometimes in order to, to, to gain insight for yourself. Yeah, but you know, higher beings, yeah, and controlling you, manipulate, no, that's not what I encounter at all. We are subject to the lizard queen, you know. <laughs> <laughs>